Welcome back. Sioux Falls Food Tours is hosting a cocktail showdown. Joining us this morning to talk about the showdown mm -hmm. is Dana Wolland. How are you? Yeah. Great. How are you, ladies? Yes. Good. What do you have in store for us today? <gasps> the I know. Oh, this is what everyone's going to be oh. worrying about. But. <laughs> yeah. um, so we have uh, this month's cocktail is Irish coffee. Mm. And so I thought I'd bring in the front runner, which was from Blarney Stone. Ooh. And so they get a, gave us our uh, Irish coffee for this morning. Mm. I bet they do a great job. Yeah. They, they are better at putting on the the cherry. <laughs> the cherry than I am. I had to kind of build it here. So. I think you should have built it on camera. I, was, I, think, I, was like, I think it has charm. I think it's, you yeah. know, it's almost like sledding. It kind of fell down yeah. the whipped cream yeah. mountain. That's fine. Go. It's yeah. festive. So for those that don't know too much about the cocktail showdown, could you kind of explain what it is? Mm -hmm. Well, each month we feature a cocktail. Um, this month is Irish coffee because it's mm -hmm. a nice time to have, well, I thought it'd be a nice time for yeah. hot, <laughs> hot drinks, but yeah. the weather has been fairly warm. Mm -hmm. Um, so we each week we go to three different places and try three different high-end cocktails and we get to rate them nice. and then the next week we go to three more and the next week we go to three more and on the fourth and final week we go to the winners of the three to crown a champion Wow! so what kind of stops do you make what other businesses do you tend to visit during this cocktail showdown um, well there's so many we can yeah. visit right. so uh, Honestly, one of the ones that surprises people is Papa Woody's. Oh. They have a full bar and yeah. they make like great drinks there. Oh. Smoked old fashioned. Yeah. Um, uh, we, of course, like the Treasury, yeah. um, Carpenter, oh, yeah, Highball, JJ uh, Spirits out there, uh, Tavern 180. So mm -hmm. we'll go anywhere. Um, in town, we'll get those three drinks each week. Um, we will start with an appetizer. Mm -hmm. uh, just kind <laughs> you of can't give drink a, on an empty yeah, stomach. Yeah, give yeah, us yeah, a little taste. <laughs> this one is definitely about the alcohol and not about the food. Yeah, yeah. okay. Yeah. So it's kind of a great chance for people to get involved in maybe trying different drinks in the community versus yes. maybe food. Do you have right. any recommendations? I know, I don't know how, yeah, how, where are you guys at in the process of, you know, traveling to different, have you started yet? Or are you just now starting? We do this yeah. every Friday. Oh, okay. okay. From right. one, one to four. So you have to do a little day drinking. Mm. <laughs> well, terrible. On a Friday. <laughs> so just take a little bit of time off work and come join us yeah. for that. Um, in January though, since it's dry January, we'll be doing mocktails. Oh, so, um, you know, if you didn't want to drink alcohol before you got to have soda maybe or an orange juice. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, but now bars have definitely stepped up their mocktails as yeah. well. Yeah. And so we're going to explore those in January. Do you have any favorites that you've tried so far? Any that stick out in your memory? Um, I'm, I'm an old fashioned girl. <laughs> okay. So like the smoked old fashioned from Papa oh. Woody's actually was my my favorite I old love fashioned. those. They, wow. they fill the whole place up with such a beautiful yeah, smell. They, they do. do that. Yep. Um, yeah. No, I, I, I mean, I've been a carpenter. I've, I'm kind of, you know, we're out really different. younger, dabbling and getting we into like more cocktails yeah, and, good and more, you know, fine drinks. But, you know, it, and for the people in Sioux Falls who kind of want to get involved with this, are there any resources that they can go to or do you guys have anything sign up. online? Yeah, you can go to my website, um, Sioux Falls Food Tours. And uh, we have one every Friday. You just have to click on it and book it. And then I'll let you know where we're going, or at least where we're starting. Um, and then everybody gets a rating for each one we stop at. And then we get a vote on, you know, we get the final for that week. And then we have a champion by the end of the month. Awesome. All right. Well, I really want to try this. Yeah, I was say, we get into it. <laughs> Barbie does a great, you know, so I'll try one side. You could try the other side. Does that work? I'll try this we'll side. both we end will. up at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> we'll both end up with more whipped cream than cocktail honestly but <laughs> and I would be all <laughs> over my nose I'm sure <laughs> all right let me see Ooh, that is very good even for Not being a big early fan of it's very it's coffee it, it tastes like coffee it's coffee with <laughs> whipped cream all over my nose <laughs> it will give you some whipped cream on the nose but yeah yeah it's a no it's season. really good though so, I got yeah. I got that underneath the whipped cream and it, it yeah I love an Irish Irish coffee. Irish coffees were developed in 1943 at an airport mm -hmm. so some weary travelers had to turn around in Limerick Ireland <laughs> they were halfway across had to come back <laughs> Oh, um, and oh, so, and so the person who invented it was like, these people are hot <laughs> or cold, cold, but we need to warm but them up. Warm drink them up. So they did coffee, Irish whiskey, and cream, mm -hmm. um, and became a favorite. So do you kind of learn about some of the cocktails' history when you right. are doing these tours as well? So That's cool. I'm going to bring you up on the history of how that got invented oh. and where it came from. This one isn't necessarily the traditional. They do brown sugar at the bottom with the um, coffee, and then the whiskey and it's usually it's just cream but in America we've mm -hmm. really gone to whipped cream yeah. Yeah. but otherwise it would we just like be cream over the top <laughs> yeah. well and it's so much more fun and yeah. festive yeah. Awesome. all right well thank you for being here and showing us all about this and it sounds like such a great and fun event to yeah. join
thanks for having me. And if you're off on that afternoon, I know. I've heard. Yeah, we, we might get have it. to. We're morning people, so we yeah. get off a little early. We, we might do. have to join. <laughs>